Summer days are here, and so are two of my favorite ladies from the New Orleans School of Cooking. Please welcome back my girls, Miss Harriet and Miss Ann. Miss Harriet, Miss Ann, how y'all been? Oh, I've been great. Good, good. Really great, and it's so nice to be back. Okay, well, we, we're gonna do things a little bit differently today. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Because we're helping a viewer at home who's struggling oh. with her holiday meal. Mm. Let's say hello to Shelly. Hey, Shelly. Hey, how you doing? Hi, uh, Shelly is. Great. Okay, Shelly's joining us through a uh, video chat on the real pad from AARP. That's the real pad do. is not only the perfect tablet to help you connect, learn, and share, it also comes preloaded with all of your favorite social media apps on it, too. Wow. So that's a new thing that's out this year. You might want wow. to look into that. So what are we making today? Okay, today we're going to Shelly. It is a roast crown of pork. That's how you call it and have the butcher do all of the work, okay? Yeah. You're paying okay. for it. So okay. um, all you're gonna do is make, you know, if you know how to make, you know, just tie it. Just tie the middle. Is that what you've done? Yeah. Yeah. Now, take another one, not at the bones, but right below it. I think I got it. You got it. That's it, cut it. I'm tied up, that's good. You're tied. Now look, we're gonna do the bones. Okay. You know, I think they call this a slip knot. Yeah, here, let me do what? that. You do that. I just do you. it. Stick it on one of them, go around. Oh, just put it on one of them? Yeah, Oh, like around. lasso it. Yeah, just, just pull it together, pull oh, it together. No, done that and before. you're doing that to give it a uh, base. That's it. Cut some of this string Yeah, cut off it off. You don't need all of that. Work with you it. done this before? Yeah, well, not, not, not with pork. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing, Steve. <laughs> You're doing a good job. You're doing a good job, Shelly. I'm gonna pull it together. There you go. There you go. Okay, yeah. now, I am just going to turn the roast. Come on, Shelly, turn it upside down. You know, we're trying to be neat with the paper. And we're gonna put a few garlic cloves in, okay? That's okay. It. It's gonna be perfect. And you see your little sliced garlic? Oh, in the meat? Yeah. yeah, we're gonna make little holes. Don't go all the way through, because you don't want it to drip. There we go. Yes, yes. Yes. How are you doing out there? Any Perfect. One? Yeah, whichever put one. one in each yes, one. yes. And you no. just slice them, make little inserts with your knife, and stick it in there. Right in there. And yeah. do that with any kind of roast that you cook. Any kind of roast. Hang yeah, in. with okay. anything. Hang okay, in you please. ready? Yes, ma'am. Okay, now I'm gonna put my seasoning blend on. You know, you need a seasoning blend. And the one we picked today is Joe's stuff, because we're most, I mean, we use it all the time. It has all the right. spices in it. I added some sugar to it, some sage. Oh my gosh, mm -hmm. sage, and no worries, it's gonna get on you, so this be careful. This is my specialty right here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, my mom in heaven watching this. I gotta oh, shut I this down. Oh, my mother's not watching. My, I, got, I gotta shut this down. I gotta get this down. Oh, from... yeah. Okay, get we it got in. it all. You got in it. Here. All right, move it in. Yes. And there is your roast, and that's what you're going to put in the oven. Are you gonna put a little liquid in there, Harry? Just no. Just nothing? Okay. Shelly, 300 degrees for two to two and a half hours. Okay. okay. All right. All right, now, after now, that's ready. Go ahead, Harry. When the roast comes out, after two right. hours, two and a half, you have your glaze. That's right. In your little yeah. pot. Put it on Got my little pot. Okay. All right, orange marmalade. Get the sweet orange marmalade. Yeah. Seville is another type of orange marmalade. And this is Grand Marnier. It's very bitter, okay? But so you're you from Kentucky, sweet. so you could use Kentucky bourbon if you wanted to, you know? <laughs> this is orange juice, okay? Yeah, you can get that thing right over at your house. All right. That's right. And then- Get that Kentucky bourbon with that orange marmalade. Put both of them in there. <laughs> and look, just cook this until it gets, you know, melted. And, and you want it this consistency. Turn it over when he comes out of the oven and put it back in. Glaze, glaze, glaze. Put it back okay. in uh, and hour, increase huh? that temperature because remember, this hasn't gotten brown yet. So increase okay. the temperature from 300 to five. 500, okay. If these start, the little ribs start getting too, too, too cooked, burned, you know, uh -huh. then cover it with uh, a piece of, let me show you, tin foil. tin foil. Fold it over okay. like this, like this, like this. You know, it's not that many things. And then just put it around it. Cover them like 
this. Okay. And that will keep them. And that's it. It's going to come out when that internal hey. temperature reaches 140. I, well, Miss Hare, come on. What, what, why you keep, what, what you, what is that, Grand Marnier? Yeah, that goes yeah, in yeah. your sauce. That goes in your glaze. I saw that. that okay. I'm not, I don't really know what that is. I just. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, yes. Watch out for that. Shelly, when you... they all go home, that's when you feel like, God, get, you know. No matter. Wow, oh, wow. Nice. look here, boy. It's gorgeous. Oh. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty. Can you see this, Shelly? Yes, this what product? is that? Oh. We've got oh. the finished roast over here. This is beautiful. Want to taste it? Mm. Yeah, let me Oh, go. yes. Get down deep. Now, let me tell you, the cranberry relish has orange in it, so you can see the tie-in with the roast yeah. that has the orange <clears throat> marmalade, the Grand Renee and everything. Isn't that right. delicious? Potatoes are awesome. Here, I'll take yeah, here, here. Mm. The first part was the praline sweet potatoes. And if you have any potatoes left over, you take a hand blender, you know those immersion blenders, you, and it makes a wonderful <laughs> yeah. potato soup. You want a piece of the... Come on, roast. You know, I'm going to try this roast for you. Come I'm, on, come I'm, on. I'm, I don't like y'all come down here. You're the oh, king man. of the house. Come on, do let's get it. all this get cooking it. in the end. Just go from the top yeah. down. Shelly, another thing you could do, if you didn't want to decorate it like we did, it's, it was just really pretty. You could also stuff this with oyster stuffing, rice dressing, anything like that, Shelly. Mm. Okay. <laughs> oh, uh. <laughs> hey, listen, Shelly. Yes. We've loaded Miss Ann and Miss Harriet's recipe into your real pad. And if you ever need assistance finding them or anything else on your tablet, you can reach out to Real Pad's free 24-hour customer service. Wow. They're open 24 okay. hours. They get you anywhere you need to go. Ladies, thank you so much. Miss wow. Harriet. Thank you. Miss Ann, I love you, girl. We and listen, folks, find these recipes and more about AARP's Real Pad at steveharveytv.com. We'll be right back, folks. <laughs>